Let's go to Puerto Rico. The Trump administration on Friday announced it is sending nearly $13 billion in federal aid to Puerto Rico to help it recover from 2017's devastating Hurricane Maria. To rebuild Puerto Rico's electrical grid and educational system. The announcement comes just days after Trump's presidential rival, Joe Biden, courted Hispanic voters in Kissimmee, Florida, which received a big influx of people from Puerto Rico after the territory was devastated by Maria three years ago. Biden cited what he called Trump's, quote, neglect of Puerto Rico, echoing top Democrats Friday who said Trump had delayed and withheld the aid for the last three years, stunting Puerto Rico's ability to rebuild from the storm that killed more than 2,500 people and left the island without power for weeks. Biden also reminded voters of Trump's response on a visit to the island after Maria, during which he tossed paper towels into a crowd in a manner similar to tossing basketballs into a hoop. I'm not going to throw paper towels at people whose lives have just been devastated by a hurricane. The world saw that. Not just the United, the world saw that. It was mortifying. Trump has defended his handling of the hurricane recovery effort. Uh, why not a year ago? Why not two years ago? Why not three years ago? Why Questioned about the timing of the aid package Friday, Trump blamed Democrats and said, quote, we've been working on it for a long time to get it passed. Since Maria, Puerto Rico has weathered more hurricanes, earthquakes, the coronavirus pandemic and political upheaval, as well as increased federal scrutiny into its use of U.S. aid.